Kia Sorento 2025. Mid-size SUV shoppers who wander into a Kia showroom these days are spoiled for choice. Not only is there a three-row Telluride and electric EV9, but you'll also find the 2025 Sorento and Sorento hybrid models, each serving similar missions with three rows of seats, a practical cabin, and plenty of curb appeal. A non-turbo four-cylinder and front-wheel drive are standard. All-wheel drive is optional, as is a punchy 281 HP turbocharged four-cylinder. A rugged X-Pro trim sits atop the lineup and offers more off-road capability. Two hybrids are also offered one a plug-in with up to 32 miles of electric driving per charge. The entry-level models don't penalize you for being on a budget, and Kia packs each Sorento with a competitive list of standard features, including wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, a suite of driver assists, and plenty of other conveniences. The Sorento has a wide selection of engine options and is available with front or all-wheel drive. A 191 HP 2.5 liter inline four cylinder engine is standard, and a 281 HP turbocharged 2.5 liter four cylinder is available too. Both pair with an eight speed automatic transmission, and the hybrid model uses a six speed automatic. We drove a top of the line SX trim with the Turbo 4 and appreciated its noticeable thrust, but we wish the powertrain felt more responsive off the line. The same model delivered poised handling, a nicely isolated ride, and firm brake pedal feedback. The eco-friendly Sorento Hybrid features a turbo 1.6-liter four-cylinder gas engine and an electric motor that work together to generate 227 horsepower. The all-wheel drive Sorento plug-in hybrid features the same engine and transmission as the lesser hybrid, but in this application, the powertrain makes a combined 261 horsepower courtesy of a more powerful electric motor. The X-Pro trim comes only with the turbocharged 2.5-liter four-cylinder and gets a center-locking differential, 17-inch wheels, and all-terrain tires. The Sorento's interior has an attractive layout, nice materials, and solid build quality. The dashboard is bookended by two upright air vents, but is otherwise simplistic in its design. Ambient lighting is smartly incorporated into the cabin, and stitched surfaces on the door panels and seat inserts provide an upscale appearance. A variety of cubby storage spots and cup holders contribute to the Sorento's family-friendly mission. Along with a standard third row, its second row bench can be swapped for a pair of captain's chairs. The Sorento comes with an infotainment setup that consists of two screens mounted side by side in a curved panoramic display, a 4.3 inch digital gauge display and a separate 12.3 inch infotainment touchscreen are standard, but higher end trims get a larger 12.3 inch reconfigurable gauge display instead. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe.